All right, you guys, I'm back with another 45 minute full body body weight workout today. We're just gonna go ahead and jump right into it, starting with your stretch. All right, go ahead and bring both feet to the back of your mat. <clears throat> starting with your inchworms, guys, drop your fingertips down to your toes, walk your hands all the way out to your high plank. Once you get here, decide which leg you wanna bring up first. That leg comes up to the outside of that lead hand. That same side hand reaches for the sky. Open your torso up to the side of the room. Come back down to your high plank. That foot goes back. Opposite leg comes up. Same side hand reaches for the sky. That's it. Big reach, big extension. Back down to your high plank. All right, walk your fingertips all the way back into your toes. Jump right into this whenever you're ready, you guys. We're here for a minute. Down to your toes and just stretch all the way out to your high plank, right? Right or left foot comes up. Same side hand reaches for the sky. Open your torso up. Now drop your hips just a little bit further. Right, feel that, open up your hip flexors, open up your hips, both hands back to your mat, opposite leg comes up, same thing. Other side, right hand reaches, or left hand reaches up. Again, drop your hips down, open up your hip flexors, drop both hands back down to your mat, right back into your high plank. Pike your hips, walk your fingertips back to your toes. Let's do it again. Drop down, walk it all the way out. Same as before, right or left leg comes up, same side comes, same side hand, Reaches up for the sky, now drop your hips. Breathe, both hands to your mat, back to your high plank, opposite leg comes up. Same side hand, reaches up, again, just breathe, smile, relax. Take a second here, bring both hands back down to your mat. You're gonna send your heels to the back wall and just stack your shoulders over your wrist. Right from here, we'll drop down to our first set of push-ups in three, in two, and one. Drop your chest down, lift it up. Now as we push up, remember, Shoulders stay relaxed. Keep your elbows wide but below your shoulders, right? Try not to butterfly your elbows up by your ears. Leave it at the center of your chest. Every time we push it up, you always have the option to drop down to your knees if you need to modify. Squeeze your glutes behind you. We got five seconds left before we take this right into our mountain climbers in three, and two, and one. Hold your high plank. It's as slow or as fast as you want it to be today, right? Knees up to your chest. Hollow out your belly, bring your belly button right back in towards your spine. Right from here, we're gonna take this into our first set of burpees, all right? You'll walk or hop your feet to your hands. Add that jump at the top. Option to add the push-up at the bottom. If you don't want it, don't do it. 10 seconds left here. Walk or hop your feet to meet your hands. Add that jump at the top in three, in two, in one. All the way up, reach your hands. Plant your hands back down on your mat. Send your heels to the back wall. Walk or hop your feet to your hands. Explode up, drop your hands back down. Feet to the back wall. Again, walk or hop all the way back down. Beautiful, 10 seconds left again. This is as fast or as slow as you want to be. Remember, feel free to add that push up at the bottom. Focus on your posture. Really make your form important, right? Straight line from the back of your heels all the way up through your spine. We're here for three. We have our butt kicks in two. And one. Come up tall. Heels to the back of your legs. Knees point straight down to the floor. Chest stays proud. Hold it up, hold it up, hold it up. Use this as a moment to relax your shoulders. Alright, recover, shake off anything else we're hanging on to today. We're here for five. Back down for your push-ups. In three, in two, in one. It's as fast or as slow as you want it to be. Drop down, push it up. Hollow out your chest, spread your collarbone, breathe. Squeeze it at the top. 10 seconds left, back to your mountain climbers. As slow or as fast as you want it to be. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Knees up. Abs stay tight. Same as before, taking this into your burpees. Walk or hop your feet to meet your hands. And then add that jump at the top. That push up at the bottom is optional. Relax your shoulders, relax your chest in 10. Walk or hop feet to your hands. We got five, four, three, two, one. Walk or hop your feet to your hands. Drop it all the way down. Push up at the bottom if you want to. Explode up. Come into that low squat. Feet to the back wall. Low squat. Now jump. Low squat. Hands to your mat. 
all the way down. 15 seconds left. We have our high knees one more time and you're done with your warm up. Come up, reach, top down, push it up. We're here for three, for two, for one. Last time, right back to your high knees. Knees point straight down. Sorry, butt kicks. Butt kicks, butt kicks, butt kicks. Butt kicks, butt kicks, butt kicks. Last 10. And then we have our squats. Take the end to our leg series. In five. In four. In three, two, one. Widen your stance right into your squats. Knees stay over your toes, squeezing your glutes at the top. Sit it back, stand up, weight shifts back. Chest comes forward, squeezing your glutes, opening your hips up to the front of the room. Squeeze your butt. In 10 seconds, we're gonna take this right to the top of our mount. We have our reverse lunges, alternate your legs. Just stepping back, sinking down in three, in two, in one. Everything we do with our legs is gonna start with these three moves. Squats, reverse lunges, inside lunges. Through every series, we're gonna progress up from these baseline moves. In 10 seconds, turning this to your side lunge, parallel with the long edge of your mat, alternating your side lunges, always coming back to center. In three, in two, in one. Alternate these side lunges. Toes stay pointed to the front of the room. Hips go back first, and then you stand straight up. Hips go back first, and then you come straight up. Tailbone to the back of the room. Stand it up. Taking this back to our squats in five, in four, in three, two, one. Now we start our progression. Squat first, squeezing your glutes at the top. Stay with this right here. In 20, we're gonna turn this into a squat up, all right? At the top, explode off your toes, add that jump. We don't have to bring our knees up to our chest. You're just straightening out and exploding up off the floor. We got eight, we got six. Come on up in four, in three, in two, in one. You guys stay braced in your abs, right? Let it wrap all the way around to your lower back. Sit back, come up off your toes. Chest proud, abs set. You got this, come on. 15 seconds left and we're back to those reverse lunges, same as before, top of your mat. I'm with you, five more. For three, for two, and one. Top of your mat, alternate your reverse lunge. Back to center. Feel your feet on the floor. Right, wrap your feet all around the edges. Make that connection with your mat. Drive down through your heels. Try not to let your back leg touch the floor if you can. That's gonna come in handy a little bit later. For now though, just focusing on sinking down so you get one inch above the floor. We're here for five, we have our lunge chops. Alternating at the top of your jump. Little jumping off that front leg in three, in two, and we'll come back, switch it at the top. Hold low, explode up, switch at the top of your jump. 15 seconds here, coming back down to your mat. We got five, back to your push-ups in three, in two, in one. Shoulders over your wrists. Give me 90 seconds of really hard work right here. Option to drop down to your knees if we need to modify. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. 15 seconds here, stay with me. Stay with me, I got you. We have our half burpees. Coming up to your low squat, putting your feet back on the floor. In five, follow me. In three, in two, and one. Come up to your low squat, hold this here. Plant your hands back down, send your feet back, no push up. Hop or walk your feet to your hands, hold your low squat. Plant your hands back on the floor, chop it back. Again, halfway up, sink down into your hips. Plant your hands, 
Feet to the back wall. One more time. Hop. Come up. Plant your hands. Let's do it again. Hop. Plant your hands back down. One more time. This is it, I promise. Hop. Hold your high plank. In three, in two, in one. Into your mountain climbers. You guys, you get a recovery after this for 30 seconds. Stay with me, stay with me, stay with me. 30 seconds to go. 15 seconds before we recover. You're almost there, I know. I know. We got eight. We got six. We got four, three, two, and one. Recover, good job. Take a second. Take a second. Great job. Great job. 15 seconds to recover. Catch your breath. Hold this here. Now, to get us started in this next series, we're going to start with alternating Romanian deadlifts, all right? So just bring that back foot to the sky, dropping your fingertips down to your lead like you meet me here in three, in two, in one. Drop down and stand it up so your back leg goes back. Straight leg from the back of your heel all the way up through your spine. Try not to drop your chin down to your chest. Right, you're letting this stretch come up through your hamstrings, letting your hamstrings pull you up to the top. All right, we're gonna incorporate a little bit more balance this round. Now that we're fatigued, it's gonna be a little bit more challenging, but that's a good thing. Heel to the sky, drop down, and stand up. Try not to hunch your shoulders forward here, right? Chest stays square, belly stays tight. 20 seconds left. We're gonna keep it on our left foot. Bring our right knee back, and then up in front for a little bit of balance work. At 15, drop down. Soft bend in your knees, right? Soft bend in that lead leg, heel to the sky, flat line up your back, reach through your fingertips, squeeze through your fingertips. In three, left foot stays planted. In two, and one. Now bring your right knee all the way up. Beautiful, don't bring the right foot down to the floor if you don't have to. Kick it back, and stand it up, bounds here. Beautiful, hold your abs tight, right? Brace this, stick it back, fingertips to the floor, stand it up, 15 seconds left. Let's see if we can do this three more times. Foot comes back, you always have that option to drop your foot down if you need to on the right side. Stand up, let's go back two more times, back, and stand it up, one more time, in three, in two, in one. Right foot comes down to the floor, the left leg's going back, same thing on that left side. Send it back, left knee in front, you guys. My right knee is way weaker than my left one, my right leg. So I'm always wiggling on these. Left heel goes back, lift it up in front, balance. 10 seconds left, we're going back to the other side, left foot's on the floor. I know, 30 seconds here. In three, in two, in one. Send your right leg back, send it up on the left. Lift your right knee up in front. Right leg back, stand it up, beautiful. Brace your abs all the way around to your lower back. Kick your right heel back. Stand it up, 15 seconds left, we're almost there. We gotta go back to the left one more time. Make sure you're feeling that stretch in the hamstring of your left leg, right? That's what you're using to drop down and to lift your body back up. We're here for three, right foot on the floor, in one. Bring it down, left heel back, same thing, left knee up in front, send it back, stand it up, left knee up in front, balance. Yes, guys, drop it down to your fingertips, stand it up. I got you, send it back, and stand it up. 10 seconds left, we're just gonna alternate those Romanian deadlifts, knees are coming are not coming up in front anymore. We're just coming back to the floor in three, in two, in one. So send your left leg back, stand up to two feet. Right leg goes back, stand up to two feet. Curl your toes, left heel back to two feet, right heel back, spine stays straight. Try not to hunch forward, right? As much as you can, focus on your form. 10 seconds left, we're taking this into our side lunges. In three, alternate this in two, and one. Parallel with the edge of your mat, the long side. Alternate these side lunges again. Get back to center. One right, 
one left. Sink it down, hips go back first. Oh, push off that outside leg. Bring it back to center, beautiful. Now in 10 seconds, sorry, we were here for a whole minute, so we got 30 seconds left. At the end of this 30, instead of pushing off your outside leg and coming back to center, what I wanna do is push straight up on that outside leg and let your inside leg, knee, come up in front. Again, focus on balance, right? Focus on stability, finding your feet and feeling them on the floor, right? Confidence in your body in 10. That inside leg comes up to your knee in front, same place as it was before with those RDLs in three, in two, in one. So you drive out to that outside leg. Now lift up and bring that knee in front. Come down, bring that knee up. Beautiful. That leg comes down, bring that knee up. Now if you need to come to your feet, that's fine. Come back down to that side lunge. Opposite leg comes up in front, balance on that outside leg. Beautiful, if you need to come to your feet, that's fine. Drop it in, stand it up, squeeze your abs. Beautiful, drop it down. There it is. Ah. Wide drive straight up. That knee comes up in front, beautiful. Lead leg comes down, inside leg comes up in front. You guys, 15 seconds left. We're almost there, coming down into your high plank, holding it there, meeting me on the floor. In 10, just your right side leg lifts from your high plank. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Hold your high plank, right leg goes straight up. Right leg goes straight up. Squeeze your glutes. Just send it straight up, heel to the sky. Point your toes straight down at your mat. 20 seconds here, straight up. Squeezing your butt. Squeezing your glutes. Try not to overcompensate through your lower back. Right, straight line up through your spine. Squeeze your butt. We're coming down to all fours. That tabletop position, we have our donkey kicks. Bend your right knee to 90 degrees. It's like you're planting the bottom of your foot on the ceiling. In three, in two, in one. Just the right side. Knee stays bent to 90 degrees. Now, if we had weights that we could use, I would want you to pretend that you had a dumbbell right in that crease of your knee and you have to keep it there, right? So we have to keep that 90 degree bend in your knee, planting the bottom of your foot, the sole of your foot up on the ceiling. 10 seconds left, we have that left side kick up. Sorry, that left side leg lift out of your high plank in three, in two, and we'll come back to your high plank. Left side leg lifts, heel to the sky, drop it down, just touch your toes down to your mat. Squeeze your glutes at the top. 15 seconds left, we'll come right back into it. Those donkey kicks on your left side, keeping your left knee bent to 90 degrees. Plant the sole of your foot up on the ceiling. In five, in four, in three, two, one, that tabletop position. Knee stays bent to 90 degrees. Squeezing your glutes at the top. Work on that booty just a little bit today. 20 seconds here. Dropping our bellies down to our mat in 15, you guys, we have our first supermans. Now, you're using your lower back right here to brace your core, lift your arms and the top of your thighs off your mat in five, drop down to your belly, squeeze through your core, squeeze through your lower back, lifting your chest and your top and your thighs off your mat in three, in two, in one. Hold this here. <laughs> lifting your top of your thighs off your mat, Extending up through your arms, biceps right next to your ears. Point your toes. Coming down to our tabletop position in 10. Taking that moment to reset. Brace your core, use your lower back in five. Back to your tabletop in three, in two, in one. Now come back to your high plank, right into your push-ups in three, two, one. Elbows wide, drop it down, push it up. Chest drops down to your mat. Squeeze it at the top, spread your collarbone. Keep your shoulders relaxed. You got this. 15 seconds left, we have our second Superman. Same as before, use your core, right? Keep your arms and your legs lifted off your mat. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Drop down, squeeze your abs. Use your lower back here. Lift your chest off, lift your upper thighs off. Extend through your arms. Whew. 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 
We got 15 seconds left. Another set of push-ups. You're almost there. In three, in two, and one. Take this straight into your push-ups. 15 seconds here, then 15 seconds of mountain climbers. You got five, four, three, two, and one. It's as slow or as fast as you want this to be. You guys are gonna finish this round with 30 seconds of burpees in 10. Walk or hop your feet to your hands. You guys, you get a recovery after this. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Walk or hop your feet to your hands. Big jump at the top. Both feet to the back wall. Send it back and stand it up. Let's go. Huh. Bring it back. All the way up, explode. Beautiful. 15 seconds left. You get to recover after this. Come on. I got you. I got you. We got five. We got four. We got three, two, and one. Breathe. 30 seconds to recover. If you need your water, now's your chance. We're halfway home. Now that you've had that moment to breathe, bring it back to center. Get this next round started. We're starting with cherry pickers, all right? So we're coming down, pulling that same side knee up to that same side elbow. So you're here and you're here. We get here at three, in two, in one. Squeezing your obliques, using them to bring your same side elbow down to that same side knee. As fast or as slow as you want this to be. We're here for five, taking this right into your butt kicks. In three, in two, and one. Take this right to your butt kicks, heels to the back of your leg. Chest stays proud. In five, we're gonna drop just down into our chair pose. Options to bring your biceps up to your ears. In three, in two, in one. Sink back to your chair pose, just hold this here. Now, this one's gonna be all about holds. All right, holds and then reps. So we'll hold this chair pose for 15 seconds. And then we're gonna take this into our body weight squats. But we're gonna hold for three counts every time we get to the bottom. So you sink your hips back, pull your belly button in, straight line up through your spine in five, come up and then right back down and hold for three and three in two, you want to stand up, drop, hold, two, three, up, drop, down, one, two, three, stand up, drop, down, one, two, three, stand up, drop, down, one, two, three, stand up, drop, down, one, two, three, squeeze your glutes, drop, down, one, two, three, squeeze your glutes, drop, down, one, two, three, hold it up, drop, down, one, two, three, you got one more, sing it back. One, two, three, bring it right to the top of your mat, into your reverse lunges. Get right here in three, in two, in one. Now remember what I told you earlier when we were talking about reverse lunges. Keeping your knee, one knee off the floor. In 15, we're gonna do the same thing we just did with our squats, except we're gonna do it out of our lunge. And I want you to hold that back knee down for three counts, one inch above the floor. In five, it's three counts on each side. In three, in two, and one. One, two, three, come up. Opposite leg. One, two, three, stand up. Drop down. One, two, three. Back knee stays one inch off the floor. One, two, three. Yeah. Send it back. One, two, three. Get up. 15 seconds left. Opposite leg goes back. Stand it up. Bring it back. Two, three. Get up. Bring it back. Two, three. Get up. One more time. Back, two, three, hold it here. Back to your body weight squats. Holding down, two, three, come up. Next time, and one, two, three, hop at the top. Go back, one, two, three, explode all the way up. Hold for one, two, 
three, add that jump. One, two, three, explode up through your toes. One, two, three, 10 seconds left. Let's see if we can get two more in. Two, three, come up, last one. Two, three, back to your reverse lunges. Hold back for one, two, three. Stand up opposite leg. One, two, three, this time. One chalk at the top, switching feet at the top of your jump. And two, three, come up, go back. Two, three, go up, hold back. Two, three, come up, hold. Two, three, come up. Last 10 seconds, explode up. Two, three, switch at the top. Five seconds, switch at the top. Two, three, one, two, three, bring it to two feet. Drop down to your mat, hold your high plank. 20 seconds of push-ups in five, in four, in three, two, one. Drop down, as many as we can do in 15 seconds. I got you, stay with it, stay with it. Last five, come into tabletop. Catch your breath in three, two, and one. Come to your tabletop position, reset, relax your shoulders. Dropping down to our blades, we have our Superman. In five, 20 seconds. In three, two, one. Use your lower back, use your abs. Squeeze your core, 20 seconds here. From here, we're going into our tricep push-ups, guys. Hands below your shoulders, stacking your shoulders over your wrists. Using your triceps to push you up. Holding at the top in five, in four, in three, two, one. Stack your shoulders over your wrists. Elbows come up into your ribs. Drop down. Push it up, sink down, drive up through the heel of your hand. Squeeze your triceps at the top. Whew. I know, I know. Drop down, come up. Taking this right into our half door piece. In 10 seconds, start in your low squat. Hands on the floor. In five, four, three, two, one. Walk or hop your feet to your hands. Come up to this neutral spot. Plant your hands back down, heels to the back wall. Same thing, come to two feet, drop your hands back down. Send it back, come to two feet, halfway up. Sink back in your hips, drop down, halfway up again. Both hands in front, drop it back down. Heels to the back wall. 10 more seconds, then we're back down to our Superman. Plant your hands, heels to the back wall. We got five, four, three, two, and one belly on the floor, squeezing your abs. Use your lower back to lift your thighs and your arms off the floor. Biceps by your ears. We're almost there. We got one more set of tricep push-ups in 15. Let's see if we can get eight reps. That's what we're shooting for. Eight tricep push-ups, elbows in close, glutes stay tight. In five, four, three, two, and one. Push up. Drop down, come up, send through your triceps. Drive down through the heel of your hand. Keep your fingers pointed out toward the corners of the room. We're almost halfway there, you guys. Get there, squeeze at the top. 10 seconds left, we're almost there. Coming to your tabletop position, down to your knees. Excuse me, we have one more set of half burpees. In five, four, three, two, one, right back up to your half burpees. Beautiful. Heels back, squeeze it at the top, sink back into your hips. Open up your hips. Open up your body. Spread your collarbone. 15 seconds left, and we have our body with squats coming up from the bottom. You guys, we have 10. You're almost there. In five, just your body with squats. In three, two, one, stand up. Squeeze your glutes. Press back, get up. Go ahead and squeeze it at the top. You got this. You got this. Come on. We're almost, almost, almost there. We got one set of high knees. In 10, knees up. In five, four, three, two, Knees up and front, off your toes. Squeeze your belly, squeeze your abs. Stay braced, stay engaged. I got you, 
Stay with me, stay with me, stay with me in 15. Taking this into your butt kicks. Last 30 seconds of your round, and then you get to recover. You guys are almost, almost, almost there. Butt kicks in five, in four, in three, two, one. Heels back, right into your butt kicks. Light on your toes. Let's stay with this right here. Chest up, abs set. Excuse me, 20 seconds left. You're almost there. Knees point straight down. Open up your hip flexors. 15. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Last 10. Stay with me. Stay with me. Stay with me. We got five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Recover. 30 seconds here. Catch your breath. Great job. Great job. last 12 minutes of work before we stretch okay starting right back where we finish in your body weight squats we hit those in three in two in one sink back and stand it up i know it's a lot of squats today we get 30 seconds here and then we're going to take this up into our squat hops again but this time it's going to be a pencil hop so when we come up to the top of your jump bring your palms and your heels together and then come down to your wide stance when we land, all right? It's a quick movement. You're driving into that midline, hands are coming up. It's a lot harder than you think it is. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Come back, together at the top. Squeeze at the top, straight line, up through your midline, heels together, hands together at the top. Reach just like we're diving in a pool, except the water's above our head. I don't know if that makes any sense. 15 seconds. Back to your butt kicks, a moment to recover. Not quite a full recovery, active recovery. Heels to the back of your legs. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Right back to your butt kicks. Knees are pointing straight down. You guys get one more round of those two things in 10 seconds. Starting with your body weight squats. Feet wide. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Start with your body weight squats. Squeeze your glutes at the top. Let's go. Let's go. We're gonna flip through this one more time before we get down to our mat and finish our workout with eight minutes of abs. In 10 seconds, right back into your pencil squat hops. Coming into that midline at the top. In five, four, three, two, one. Feet and hands together at the top, last round. You got this, you got this. Touch your heels and then widen your stance. Go up, halfway there, 15 seconds left. Stay with me, we're dropping back down to our mats on your back. In 10, right into your flutter kicks, flat on your back. In three, in two, in one. Back, flat on your mat, feet three inches off the floor. Flutter your toes, squeeze your abs. Get here in three, two, one, 20 seconds. I know, I know, we're almost there. 10 more, right into your leg lifts. Heels to the sky, in five, shoulder blades on the mat, in three, two, one. Lift up, drop down, lift up, drop down. You use your lower abs to bring your heels up, right? Squeeze from the bottom of your torso to bring your heels up, 15 seconds left. And then we have our oblique heel taps. Coming halfway up into your crunch, alternating those to heel taps. One right, one left. Stay up in that half crunch. In five, four, three, two, one. Heels are on the floor. 
alternate these heel taps. Use your obliques to pull you to either side, right? Don't drop your shoulders down. Don't leave with your shoulders. Chest is square to the ceiling. 10 seconds left. We have our bicycles. As many as you can do. It's quick, but it's not in a hurry. Right? It's not a rush. In three, in two, in one. Right knee, left elbow, left knee, right elbow. You guys, you get a recovery after this flat on your back for a whole 30 seconds. And then we get into this last stretch of abs to take us home in 15. Flat on your back. We let this go and breathe. In 10. I know. Stay up. Stay up. You guys are almost there. Last five. Last four. Three, two, and one. Flat on your back. Recover. Breathe. I got you. I'm staying with you. We're staying in this. 20 seconds to recover. Open up your heart, open up your chest. Keep that confidence today. All right, don't let it go. Don't let it go. Don't let it go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. In 10 seconds, we're taking this up into our jackknives. Not yet, you're just gonna watch me first. Pike your feet up to meet your hands. Hands go to the back wall, heels come up. We go in five, four, three, two, and one. Hold it up the top, that's it. Reach your hands for the top of your feet. Right now, 20 seconds here. Pike up, feet up. That was my mat. Come on up, heels to the sky. 10 seconds left, we're almost there. Pike, pike, arms back, arms up. Five more, just toe touches. Feet stay up in three, in two, in one. Heels stay up, just reaching for your toes. Just reaching for your toes. Come up off your mat, shoulder blades off, chin stays off your chest. You're almost there, you guys. Feet are coming back down in 20 seconds for your crunch. <sighs> Last 10, see if we can get five more reps, five more big crunches. We got five, we got four, three, two, one. Heels on the floor, just crunch. Woo, just crunch. Ha, I know, I know. I'm with you, I'm with you. Try to keep your chin off your chest. Right? We don't put any extra pressure on our neck. 15 seconds left, we're almost there. Knees are coming up to that upside down tabletop. Trying to meet your elbows to your knees. Stay in crunch, just lifting your knees up. In five, four, three, two, one. Knees up, go ahead and crunch. Come up. Whoo! Keep going, keep going, keep going. Squeeze it. Make it happen today. Fuck it up today. 15 seconds and then we extend this. Feet are going to the wall. Shoulders drop to your mat. You get a big recovery in 10, in 40 seconds. We get to recover, but in five. Feet to the wall. Shoulder blades to the mat. In three, two, one. Extend out. Come up in that crunch. Extend out. Come up in that crunch. Whoo. I know, we're burning it out, you guys. We get a recovery after this. I know, I'm pushing myself with you. I'm pushing myself with you. I'm not gonna be able to talk here in a second. 15 seconds. You guys, we got five. We got four. Recover in three, two, and one. Let it go, recover. Quick recovery, 30 seconds here. And then we're gonna finish with our obliques. Ah! Last four minutes of abs. And then we get a quick stretch to take us home in 15. Coming back up into your crunch, heels on the floor. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna be burning after this in five. Just your crunch, chin off your chest in three, two, one, come up. Burn this out. Ah! We want to get to that place where we can't do any more reps, right? Where you push yourself to having to recover, right? To having to catch your breath, having to stop, feeling that burn. 15 seconds left. Coming over to your left side, we have our right side oblique crunches. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Over to your left side, up to your oblique crunch. If you can bring your leg up, 
to meet your elbow. Go for it, right? However we can progress this move is fine with me, right? Bringing your leg up is gonna engage more of your lower obliques, right? Option to keep that leg on the ground. 10 seconds left, we're taking it to the other side. Squeeze your obliques, you got this, last five. Last four, switch it around in three, two, and one. Switch it around, you're on your right side for that left side oblique crunch. If you messed it up, don't worry about it, just hit that other side, you're fine. Don't think too much about it, right? If we fuck up, don't dwell. Just move on to the next thing, right? We'll get back to it, we'll get it next time. We're gonna have more opportunities in 10. Back to your crunch, heels on the floor. Whew. We're almost there, we're almost there. In five, just crunch. In three, in two, and one. Heels on the floor, back to your mat. Squeeze it at the top. Whew. Up and drop, up and drop. Shoulder blades off your mat, chin to the ceiling. Squeeze it at the top. In 15 seconds, we have one more round of leg lifts. Heels to the sky. In 10. Shoulder blades stay flat on your mat. In five, in four, three, two, one. Heels to the sky. You guys, this time we're only here for 15 seconds. Use your lower abs. And then we're gonna alternate this leg lift. But we're gonna reach for our toes. So when your left leg comes up, your right hand is gonna reach for your left foot. Let your shoulder blades come off your mat. In five, in four, in three, two, one. Left knee up, right leg up. Left leg up, right leg up. Back to your crunch in 10. Alternating these big toe touches. Five more seconds, big crunch in three, two, one. Heels on the floor, just crunch. You guys, this is the last 30 seconds of your workout. I know, it snuck up on us. 10 seconds, and then we have our bicycles. Right knee, left elbow, control it. Slow and controlled. But we move in three, in two, and one. Right knee, left elbow, left knee, right elbow. We're here for eight. We're gonna speed it up in five, four, three, two, one. Pedal it out. Last 15 seconds of your workout. You guys were almost there. Ah, we got eight. We got six. We got four, three, and two. And one, let it go. That's what I'm talking about today. Great job. Oh. Catch your breath. Take a second. Breathe. Oh my. While you're on the floor, reach your hands to the back wall and interlace your fingers. Flip your palms. To that back wall, pull your elbows in towards your ears. Now bring your hands up above your chest. Again, pulling your elbows into the center, gauging through the center of your chest. Drop your hands back down to the floor. Again, let this stretch accelerate up from your heels, through your legs, through your torso, through your chest, armpits, arms, elbows, wrists, fingertips. Go ahead and sit up. Both feet out in front of you on your mm -hmm. mat. Heels to the front wall. Go ahead and take your right leg, cross it in front of your left, give it a big squeeze. Both arms wrap around. Now lengthen out your spine, right from your tailbone all the way through the bottom of your neck. Sit up tall, drop that foot down. Left, or foot, left leg comes over the top. Give your left knee a big squeeze. Again, straighten up through your spine. And just breathe. Drop your leg back down. We're gonna bring both knees in towards your chest. Give them a big squeeze, drop back down to your spine, onto your mat, and just roll it out. Go ahead and come flat again. Sit up tall. Bring your right arm across your left. Loop your left hand underneath. Squeeze your bicep in toward the center of your chest. 
Now you're gonna plant your heels on the floor, take your right hand, swoop it behind your back, flat on your mat, reach your left hand for the back wall, lift your hips off the floor. Hold this here for three, two, and one. Drop it down, left arm comes across your body. Same thing, right arm comes underneath, pulling your bicep in towards your chest. Same as before, swing that left arm back and behind you to your mat, flat on the floor, reaching your right hand for the back wall, lifting your hips up off the ground. Hold this here for three, for two, and one. Go ahead and bring your butt back down on the floor. Bring your feet underneath you. Bring your hands, plant them down on the mat, widen your stance. Now drive down through your heels, lift your hips up to the sky. Slowly pull your fingertips up off your mat. You're gonna come up one vertebrae at a time. Guys, just establishing yourself on the floor. Down through your heels. Connect through the balls of your feet. Bring both hands all the way above your head. Take a big deep breath in. And let it go. We have that one more time. One, two, three, all the way up. And let this go. You guys, go have a wonderful day. Let me know if you have any questions, any comments, any concerns. Down in the comments below, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, and make sure you come back. Have a great day. Thank you.